Oh, I can't even make that. Woo! Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, so we're to caution right now. So I was progressing these like four inches at a time, right? Using a chair here and a ruler to measure progress of my partials as range of motion gets longer but I do notice that the exercise becomes exponentially more difficult so that last set I tried to go out to 28 inches one rep was like near max effort so I dropped it back two inches I was able to do uh, a pretty hard set of five Ooh, I'm going to be feeling that one for sure. Another thing I've noticed with this exercise is, uh, at least for me, it seems like a narrow, a narrow stance, if you will, is better. So I try to keep my knees somewhat close together, maybe just like a fist and a half or something apart from each other. Uh, that way I can engage my adductors and like my glute medius and stuff a little better. And have more stability in general as I do this, which is pretty important. You don't want to like blow out your knees, so definitely engage the inner and outer hips as well as the hamstrings and glutes, obviously, to uh stabilize yourself on this one. Holy shit, almost cramped in that last rep. <laughs> this is how I've been getting my hamstrings strong, man, for all those heel hooks. My heel hook's been feeling real good lately in climbing, so uh, I'm gonna keep doing this exercise again. Just about once a week, man. Seems to be enough for me. Anyway, workout's over. Time to cool down. Peace out.